So many media outlets, basically every media outlet, after we reported the findings of La Quinta Columna, fact-checked the information and said that it was false. Now, the media is actually backing off of that narrative, and the vaccine manufacturers have basically admitted that graphene oxide is in these vials. It's basically common knowledge now that graphene oxide exists in these vials thanks to your research. Has your safety or life been threatened since we reported your findings at La Quinta Columna? Sí, probablemente. Yes, some of the people who has been talking about uh, what they found, um, they uh, are found dead, like uh, some people that... Um, that they uh, know. Um, there is two doctors, and the doctor, Andreas Noak, and there is another doctor, an Italian doctor, that he was uh, searching and all that. And yeah, uh, I have to take some uh, care, you know, and some uh, for, for myself. Que evidentemente estoy vivo. Es decir, no es un espejismo ni es un clon. No he sufrido ningún tipo de percance, como al parecer determinado canal italiano está haciendo ver. Poco tiempo o nada he prestado la atención de esa noticia. Pero está muy relacionada precisamente con el avance que hicimos en su momento del supuesto doctor Viscardi. Tampoco hemos tenido contacto alguno con ese doctor, como él supuestamente dice. Digo supuesto doctor, no sabemos si está muerto. Ustedes ya saben que estamos precisamente en una batalla de información real y una contrainteligencia que realmente se dedica a insertar bulos oficiales, especialmente todos los días en nuestros tres diarios y además eh, en las redes sociales, contrainformación o más bien desinformación.